What are five benefits of walking? Hi and welcome everyone, my name is Dustin Ripkins and this is actually my very first educational video here on YouTube. So I'm super stoked to bring you even more value, but I must admit I'm a little nervous too because I like to move a little better than talking sometimes. So thank you for being here, I appreciate you. And let me know in the comments below how you like this video, does it bring you value? And if so, what are topics in the future that you want me to cover and what are questions you have that I can give you the answers to. But today we're talking about what are the five benefits of walking. Let's go. Before I answer the question, let me give you a quick background about myself. My name is Dustin Ripkins and I'm a certified personal trainer. I've been in the fitness industry for over 16 years and I helped hundreds of clients of mine on their fitness journey to feel better, stronger and to lose weight. Walking is a great way of exercising and provides numerous benefits. Benefit number one. This is my personal favorite benefit and that it is low impact. Walking is low impact. Now what does that actually mean? Well, walking, we're just stepping one step in front of the other. We're not jumping in the air and landing hardly meaning it's gentle on the joints and you most likely not going to injure yourself by walking and that means the vast majority of the people, most people can use walking for a way of exercising. Benefit number two. According to Healthline, there are great health benefits of walking. For example, improved heart rate, decreased risk of chronic disease and increased immunity function, meaning their overall health benefits that are very important to not just age well and nicely, but also for your overall health. So walking can give you a lot of health benefits when it comes to your heart rate, your immune system, and to decrease the risk of chronic disease. Benefit number three, walking supports weight loss. The Mayo Clinic suggests that the greater the frequency, distance and pace of walk, the greater the weight loss component, which totally makes sense, right? If you walk for 45 minutes, you burn more calories than walking for 15 minutes and therefore you burn more calories, which would then support and helps you on your weight loss journey. Also, society recommends 10,000 steps a day. Walk 10,000 steps a day and you're good. Now, this is a great goal. However, I support also the view of setting your own goals. If you normally walk 2,000 steps a day, now 10,000 steps a day seems to be unachievable. Therefore, if you set yourself a goal, hey, in a month from now, I want to get to 5,000 steps every single day, that is a great goal and you can slowly work yourself up to 5,000 steps. Then you can maintain 5,000 steps and then set yourself a goal for 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, up to 10,000 steps a day. Saying that, it's not the end all, be all. If you want to walk more than 10,000 steps a day, absolutely do so, right? 10,000 steps is just a general number that is recommended by a lot of doctors and the society. However, if you want to walk 12, 13, 15,000 steps a day, that is great too. This guy is the limit. Benefit number four, protecting your joints and overall joint health. By walking, you're protecting your joints, you're strengthening the muscles all around your joints, and at the same time, you're also lubricating your joints. Therefore, you give overall joint health to your joints and it will help them stay healthy and lubricated in the long run. Benefit number five, improve your mood and decrease stress. Have you ever had the situation where you were totally stressed, your mind was just racing and then you went on a walk and suddenly everything made a little bit more sense or at least you felt a little bit more calm and you were a little bit more in peace, right? Therefore, going on a walk, even if it's on a treadmill at the gym, at home, or I think my favorite absolutely is going outside into nature, going for a walk there, will totally help you to clear your mind, to catch a breath, and to decrease stress. This is a great 
great benefit for walking. Now to sum it all up, what are five benefits of walking? Number one, walking is low impact. Number two, you get a lot of general health benefits by walking. Number three, walking can help you on your weight loss journey. Number four, it protects your joints. And number five, it improves your mood and decreases stress. Thank you so much for staying to the very end of this video, my very first educational video of five benefits of walking. Now, of course, there are even more benefits out there that come with walking. Now, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if this video brought you value. Last but not least, as I mentioned at the very beginning, let me know in the comments below how you enjoyed this educational video and if you want me to do more. What topics should I cover? What questions do you have that I may can answer? Until then, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.